everyone. We are super A! Give a whole bunch of applause for Rose Tank and the Spirit Demon again. Now, tonight, for those of you who don't know quite yet, we are an improvised documentary team. So what that means is that we're going to perform for you all here a documentary that's made up 100% on the spot, never been done, never will be done again, but also a documentary. So we're going to learn, and it's going to be true in a way that matters. <laughs> so to start off our set, what we're going to need is a suggestion. I'm going to need from the audience an object that could fit on this stage. Worse. World's largest ball of string. <laughs> Probably world's largest ball of string. <laughs> Competition. Little did they know that this year would be filled with more drama, more hatred, and more <laughs> sadness than they could have ever experienced. I personally was there for the whole thing, needing it to be seen and exposed. So please, get ready for You're Not It! The documentary. <laughs> Mr. Mayor, uh, I have the seismic reports back. <laughs> yeah, so basically, uh, with the size of these yarn balls are getting, uh, the city of Bill <laughs> may be destroyed this oh, year. Man. It may be destroyed this year. Look, look, what are you doing down there in research? <laughs> <laughs> For getting really big balls of yarn. <laughs> Rev. We live on the match of a tectonic plate. We have other issues to be thinking about. We can't think about the budget right now because we have to turn the money. <laughs> no, because I have to get reelected. <laughs> I'll vote for you. I need more than just one vote. <laughs> no, this is the year of new sidewalks. <laughs> oh, oh. Here's what I think about your little yarn report. No! That's so far! <laughs> Mr. Mayor, if I can get a bunch of people to vote for you, will you agree to go and get that and have a look at it for real, for real? How many votes are we talking? 10, 20, 30? 30 million? <laughs> oh! <laughs> yeah, I've, I've been rolling yarn for about four years now. Um, it started off as just I liked knitting, and I joined the local knitting club. Um, and then I realized, actually, I could profit off of yarn rolling by participating in the yarn rolling competition. Um, I actually have some trophies here that you can see. Um, it's just, this is a giant um, ball of yarn, <laughs> um, which is kind of what you would expect for a yarn rolling competition. Um, I am looking forward to this year. Uh, I don't expect any major competition. I, I do expect to win. Um, but we'll see that I'm always welcoming newcomers. It's so cute when I give it a try. <laughs> Oh my gosh, they're working us to the bone, making all this yarn. My knuckles are bleeding. <laughs> I can't feel my fingers. I wouldn't do this because I was crafty. <laughs> I, just wanted to, I just wanted to make a scarf. Now look at us, we're trapped in the dungeon under the mayor's office. I just wanted to show my family love with homemade goods. <laughs> now look, we're behind bars. Dinners! <laughs> 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 Just that be beautiful. For no reminiscence. 
Dancing! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, the wet! I have one for you, too. Oh, hey, hey, oh, I want to surprise you. It was my third yarn festival that I had attended, and, uh, it was quite a great one because my uh, adopted father had win, won the last competition. But mysteriously, he disappeared. And the only thing that I could find in the mail was, well, a picture of us knit, looking friendly and happy, but slightly covered in water. <laughs> I just want to find my father. The old man? No, I'm telling you, I had nothing to do with that. I, I care about yarn, but not enough to silence someone or harm someone or, or kill someone. That's crazy. That would be crazy. It's, it's just yarn. It's just yarn. It's just yarn. <laughs> Have you seen this man? It's <laughs> <laughs> my papa. <laughs> Do you have a real photo? Do you have a photo of him or just the yarn? The yarn is just our tell. <laughs> I come from a place where we don't have cameras. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't crochet images. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna make it tough. Wait, wait, can I say photo one more time? I've seen, I've, oh, I've seen, I've seen that shirt before. Because I, I've never, Pikachu is a pretty like rare thing to see in this town. And the fact that I guys a Pikachu is just pretty intense. Into Pikachu. Yeah, because normally it's all yarn stuff, but... He knit the world's biggest Pikachu. <laughs> Tokyo, 1987. <laughs> well, I'll keep my eye out for him, for sure. He's a world knitting champion. And he just went missing? He went missing one day in 1987. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's bigger than us. It's way bigger than us. The government doesn't want us to be knitting. <laughs> Wait, in, in Bill? Is it the whole thing about... I'm telling you. Be careful. Okay, thank you. And keep your hands away from any threads. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, so no sweater tomorrow. Should I not wear a sweater? Don't wear it. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'm Dr. Smith, Villetown historian. We'll always remember the, the 1987 uh, yarn rolling competition where we had that one missing uh, contestant. Um, here we have a slideshow of some of those images of that specific competition. Um, clearly, two dedicated contestants <laughs> giving it their all um, in the competition. Um, these two didn't win. <laughs> they were not doing well. They sucked. They were one of the first out. Um, yeah, next slide. Now these ones really showcase a lot of artistry in their yarn uh, rolling, um, and they got like extra like stylistic points actually um, for the judges. Um, and next slide. Here, I mean, this is a, a celebration after the uh, the competition. All the contestants just go out and rally, right? There, there's a lot of bonding that happens. Um, so they're just, you know, they hit some brewskis, they're getting like frisky. Uh, <laughs> yeah, and that's, I mean, Bill is a town of many, many yarn uh, stories. So we have a uh, very storied uh, legacy. Mm -hmm. you know. <laughs> Giuseppe. <sighs> yeah, for now though. <laughs> I want to free you. Just me? I, I know who you are. Oh, I saw you. You, you recognize the name? I saw Giuseppe you. Boldini? <laughs> I saw you in Tokyo when I was a little boy. I was a different man then. In my prime. World's <coughs> biggest Pikachu fan. Get the attention of the guards. Don't splash us again. <laughs> Just trust me. Uh, hey! Hey, God! I got, I got something to say to you! Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the cage is circular. <laughs> <laughs> Watch it! <out. laughs> You're in the yard! I'm just walking in for fiber. Oh, it's cashmere. Oh my god. <laughs> if you're moving, you'll be strained. It's so soft. <laughs> it's so cold. Are you doing this for me? He's fine. Flash the 
<laughs> it's so luxury. <laughs> Good thing I needed to be a key out of the cell. <laughs> Just that. Before you go, I knitted you this sweater. <laughs> a Pikachu sweater? <laughs> yes. You do know me. Now go. Come with me. I have to find my son. I need some help. you have to meet two qualifications. Number one, you have to know what yarn is. Number two, you can pretty much do anything you want to win it to roll it up the biggest, but like, you know, it's gotta be using yarn. <laughs> That's the thing. That's the trick. You can knit whatever you need, any tools you need, you can do it. There are spots here enough for each of you if you wanted to do it, but <laughs> Be prepared. You never know what happens when you win. <laughs> well, that's going to be the first one to sign up for it. My question, what? You know what? The last part? What about it? Is that like a, a prize, right? A prize. Uh -huh. I, I have three trophies. Yeah. Okay. So Maybe. So you just make like a big ball of yarn and that's it? Yeah. That's what you're going to do whatever you can to build the biggest yarn, ball of yarn. <laughs> Yeah, what uh, up? Uh, long time knitter, first time competitor. Welcome to the belt. Uh, thank yes. you so Hi. much. Um, uh, can I use string instead of fair yarn? Uh, no. String and yarn are, they're, they're diametrically different. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you gotta use yarn. Uh, but anyway, if you guys want to sign up, uh, just careful if you win. That's all I'm going to say. Uh, okay. <laughs> My name's Guns McGee. You'll remember me. <laughs> Anyway, Guns McGee signed up. Who else? Who else? Uh, my name is uh, Bizzeppi. Not the world famous one. <laughs> trying to find my son. You know me. Just Jennifer Yarn. <laughs> Guns McGee, just because you broke up doesn't mean you gotta be a war soul. <laughs> Uh, so, be careful if you win. <laughs> yeah, be careful if you win. I, I just never heard that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Cargo Mike, uh, I'll be careful. <laughs> All right, the competition. Oh, 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 I'm so sorry. I always forget about you. Please continue. I'm, I'm Joey Bananas. I'm just uh, going to figure out a way to introduce string into the equation. They're diametrically opposed. <laughs> They're different <laughs> elements. <Same. laughs> ah, whatever. She's new here. <laughs> All right, everybody. Remember, tomorrow morning, bright and early, the competition starts. So eat your eggs, have some bacon, keep your string away from your yarn, you know, as they say. But get ready, and you might want to, you know, settle your affairs or something, just in case. <laughs> how much in case? Uh, what? Like, how in case we, are we talking? In case you win. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Everyone good? All right. Great. Oh, I'll be honest. Jennifer really did a number on my heart. I can work out my muscles, but it turns out you can't exercise your heart. <laughs> Our breakup is all over Vilbook, which is the Vil version of Facebook. Um, she tore up all my Michaels cards and poured out all my protein powder. And I'll be honest, I'll take some of the blame because I called her knitting just kind of mid. And she did not take good to that. And she showed me all her trophies and she threw them at me, but I'm going to channel all my sadness into winning! <laughs> Mr. Mayor? I've been on Reddit.com, <laughs> and I managed to secure you 464,000 votes. Now, it's not the that. Okay. It's, it's not the 30 million you asked for, but considering our town population, <laughs> considering our town population, it's just 1,200 people, and I thought it was a guarantee that you win. Now, I ran about 16 miles to where you threw the report, and I managed to decrumble it. What's it say? 
I, I told you what it says. It says the town's gonna collapse. Oh, yeah. I mean, it'll cancel the competition. But all those votes. <laughs> no, I can't cancel now. Oh, 460 million votes? <laughs> <laughs> you never listen, Mr. Mayor. That's why you're never gonna win. <laughs> With that many votes, that's, do you do math? That's crazy. Now I am gonna win. <laughs> I really, really hate you, sir. <laughs> you're, you're running the report. <laughs> Are these Yarnies good citizens? <laughs> <laughs> you should know the people, sir. The civic ship. Hey, look at my Ow! <laughs> if you're not gonna do anything, I'm gonna stop this competition myself. No. I'll stop you. <laughs> Secret Service, get in here. Oh my God. I'm the mayor, I'm the Secret Service. They're going down, down. Hey, hey, hey. You're corrupt. <laughs> Hi, I'm Carmela Cintron, and welcome to the Nitty Gritty, where we'll talk all things yarn, and we have special interviews with uh, tomorrow's contestants. Uh, we have the last year's winner, Jennifer Yarn. <laughs> Hi, thanks for having me. It's so great to be here. Uh, yeah. So tell us, how was, uh, how's your reign been? How's my what? Your reign of oh. champion. Um, well, so far, so good. Nothing bad has happened to me, even though they told me every year, be careful. So this year, we're hoping. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, what, what can we expect tomorrow? Well, I'm telling you, tomorrow, I'm really expecting, um, like, a lot of yarn, basically, because the competition does look kind of fierce. I mean, there's there's Joey Bananas, really into string, but I think, hey, bring it on. Kind of an underdog. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so cute when they chuck you down. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it could be the most yarn the town's ever seen, for all we know. Oh, that'd be the dream. <laughs> yeah, that's how it's going. Mm -hmm. yeah. What would you say is your biggest competition, then? My biggest competition? Um, the Seppi. <laughs> um, that you don't just age without learning how to knit really well. <laughs> so that freaks me out because that, that man's a lot older than mm -hmm. the rest of us. And I, I can really cry, but I know you have some history oh. with Guns McGee. And I mean, Guns joined the competition to upset me, and it does not upset me. It doesn't upset me <laughs> one little bit. Okay, okay, I might have mid knitting, but it doesn't. <laughs> Guys? No. It's fine. <laughs> Great. Uh, you can have your complimentary Garantini. Here we go. Oh, cheers. Cheers. Thanks for having me. No, thanks for dishing here at the Nitty Gritty. <laughs> <laughs> Just have me. <laughs> Don't put your hands by the fire. Try it. My hands are so cold, looking for my son. <laughs> I've just been sticking my hands in piles of snow, hoping he loves the snow. I hope he comes. I want to help you find him. <sighs> Me too. I, I was hoping, you know, he lo I taught that boy everything I know about yarning. And I thought he would come to the world's biggest yarn competition. I'm sure he'll be here. I, I, I hope he is, because I still got the, the, the fuzz on me. Ooh. <laughs> and you too. I don't know you're yes. quite in uh, trouble by this. You killed a man out there. You escaped from the this jail. I died there too. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, oh. I don't think of such things. I'm sorry. I, I'm stuck in the past. The road goes this way. Not that. <laughs> God damn it, Ronaldo, you're the most philosophical man in the world. Now let's have some grub. <laughs> Everybody right. gather around. Everybody gather around. We're beginning the competition as town gun owner. I will shoot into the air. <laughs> so, camping. You're camping? Yeah, the competition before, line? Before, before, they, they help me calm my nerves. It's extremely unprofessional. <laughs> okay, I'm. What do you shoot? I'd like to say something as the mayor. <laughs> a speech, okay? Mr. Mayor thinks he's above rank the town gun over. <laughs> I'll allow it. Citizens of Bill, I want a good, hard knit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want a clean, and I want you to vote for me after. <laughs> right, is that part of like the, the ground like, rules for the game? Or is it a suggestion? Or? Just shoot the 
<laughs> and yarn only, remember. Just yarn. I want you. Please watch. Okay, on the count of three, you'll begin commencing your knit, at which point you will have five minutes. It may feel like a lot shorter. <laughs> and then you will push your yarn down the hill from the church all the way to the dungeon. <laughs> Three, two, one. Let's go, let's go. Go, Giuseppe. Go, Giuseppe. That's two minutes. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> Jennifer, are your arms tired? Your mid minutes? <laughs> are, are your arms tired, Gun? Well, are they tired now? Oh, my God. <laughs> red, 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 referee. There was something so strange about Giuseppe. He looked so no. familiar. Almost like this photograph I got in the mail made out of yarn. But it couldn't be him, could it? Giuseppe, yes. you're knitting like a, an old knitter that I once saw when I was a child. Could you be the actual Giuseppe? <gasps> You've already figured me out. <laughs> Five minutes over. Oh, let's inspect the balls. <laughs> this isn't over. That was close. <laughs> Yawn. Six feet by six feet. Oh. I named him Bernadetto for my son. Good job, Giuseppe. <laughs> Three feet by two feet. I was settling some personal matters. People need hobbies. <laughs> Can I just say that I got stabbed in the arm? I don't want to tattle, um, but the last two minutes I had to do one arm. <laughs> Five feet by. Oh, you made a you made a rectangle. <laughs> hey, is, is it made of yarn? It's made of yarn, made of yarn. and I know what yarn is. Those are the two it's, rules. It's made of yarn. Oh, <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> do you string? String. 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 Yeah, you get one what what one quick retort. What what's your defense? Come on, to the people. I'm a scientist. <laughs> and I've created the ultimate yarn string hybrid. Well, I'm going to teach you about the science of drop kicking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's so far. <laughs> <laughs> it's qualified. It's got some legs. All right, get ready. We're going to start it up again. The gun's loaded. Are we rolling the I like the fully loaded. <laughs> Take your time. <laughs> You know the rules. Push it down the hill. <laughs> Three, two, one, and chase after it. Go! Stephanie, this isn't over. Ah! And guns, you too. Oh, my other arm! Oh, my. We didn't get her arm in this part. Fuck! I, I have to go get my ball of yarn. I'm the only one pushing it down the fucking hill. I'm not stopping to think I get my Bernadetto. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 you play dirty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I look like Tokyo. <laughs> <laughs> These are so fucking happy. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh my god, a ball of yarn. Ah! <laughs> Mr. Mayor. Wait. Don't worry, I'm a doctor. <laughs> Joey oh. Bananas. Wait, are you a scientist? I'm a doctor of sorts. I'm a PhD. I was just walking. Wait, wait, wait. My boy. My boy. Where is that now? Just happy. No! You always call me by my first name. It's beautiful. My family. I'm sorry. No.
coming. Good night.